Adjusting column width is similar in process to adjusting row height. Again, you must first select the column or columns that you want to adjust. Then, using either the ribbon and the cells group in the format option, you can adjust column width or perform an auto fit column width command from this menu. You can also use your mouse and the double arrow tool by positioning your mouse on a column border or the line between the columns so that you get the double arrow tool and then either clicking and dragging to adjust the column width or double clicking to adjust the column width. We'll set that. By default, the column width is set to 8.43 characters. You can set a column width up to 255 characters. If you set a column width to zero, you will hide that column. So let's go ahead and apply some column widths to our product list. Again, open up your product list, and if you do not have that open or would like to start with a fresh file, you can use 0507 start file that you'll find in your Excel 2007 class directory in the Chapter 5 folder. This opens the product list with all the development and edits that we have made up to this point in the tutorial. Now, let's apply adjusting column width to our column headings. So we will be looking at adjusting column A for our product heading, column B for our calories heading, and column C with our price heading. We can do this first by selecting column A and then performing an auto fit. And I'll come up here to my format option in my cells group of my home tab of my ribbon and click the format option which expands down the menu and then choose auto fit column width. This will adjust column A to a width that accommodates the longest character content that would be in one of those cells. This would be the chocolate covered blueberries. Now notice if we highlight columns B and C and perform another auto fit through the mouse by positioning my mouse on the borderline between column B and C and then double clicking I will adjust both of these columns with the one double click a very nice feature and a time saver as you develop your worksheets. Our menu is starting to shape up. You will find that adjusting row height and column width is very common and you now have many techniques for performing this type of an edit and formatting to your worksheet. Please go ahead and save your file and continue on with the next movie.